All right, here we are approaching 530. There's downtown Albuquerque. Good looking start to this Tuesday morning. Temperatures are about to make a major jump. We really haven't had the, the pool time temperature range just yet. That's coming though. Uh, rain chances slim to none for most of us. Persistently breezy to windy in this seven day forecast. Here's a look at our Tuesday and this will be a breezy afternoon, but a comfortable one with 70 and 80 degree high temperatures for most of us. These numbers are almost 10 below average. Note along the New Mexico and Colorado state line chance of storms and uh, the storms a little bit further south in that far northeast corner of the state around Raton Clayton may be nipping you in Las Vegas, but probably staying north and east. The severe weather threat or risk area is uh, containing much less real estate than yesterday. Just that far northeast corner of the state and note it's just the marginal risk, not the slight risk. So the threat level is also a step lower. Uh, after any storms wind down, overnight skies will be mostly clear. We're going to find ourselves back down in the 40s and 50s for northern New Mexico. A bit milder for the southern part of the state with 60s to about 70. Taking a step up temperature wise for our Wednesday, probably pushing any chance at storms up into the Colorado side of the state line and Thursday. Same story. Any chance at storms probably stays in southern Colorado, likely dry within New Mexico's borders. Do we hit 90 in Albuquerque? Gosh, we'll get close, but right now we've got that forecast high at 89. That'll be your first triple digit of the year, though, in Roswell, and it looks like it'll be even hotter later in the week. Let's talk about those seven day forecasts. Northwest New Mexico, four corners area clouds this afternoon. Any chance at storms probably for the high country Southwest Colorado high 70s today. We're five warmer across the board tomorrow and hanging out in the mid 80s through Friday and then it's middle and upper 80s for the upcoming weekend. But right now around Farmington, your rain chances yeah, they're essentially zeroed out for the next seven days. Uh, how about sunshine for seven days in a row basically here in Southwest New Mexico 70s and 80s today. Five warmer tomorrow 84 in Silver City means low and mid 90s off the mountains and uh, that's the temperature range we hang out in right on into and through the upcoming weekend with dry sky. Here's southeast New Mexico, 74 for Rudo. So is Fort Sumner, though, close to 90, and we will be in the 90s. Roswell down to Carlsbad over towards Hobbs. Uh, about the same story tomorrow, temperature wise, but by Thursday, yeah, there's that 101, and it's triple digits starting Thursday and continuing right on through the weekend. Just a matter of like how far into the triple digits. Northeast New Mexico, best chance that storm stays north and east of Las Vegas, but you know, around Raton and Clayton could be another active afternoon and evening. High 70s today, severe weather threat for the far northeast. Five warmer tomorrow. We hit 80 in Las Vegas on Thursday and hang out in the low 80s through the weekend. Uh, North Central Mountains. Uh, let's jump back at that real quick and take one more peek. Uh, we've got highs in the 70s. Taos, Espanola, Santa Fe, Los Alamos. Uh, closer to 80 tomorrow in Santa Fe. And we do hit 80 by Thursday and hang out in the lower 80s through the weekend. Here's the Albuquerque Metro and our average high is 90. Got the Sunport at 83. Los Lunas and Berlin maybe a little bit closer to 85, but this will be another comfortable temperature day. Uh, this is the last day we'll say that uh, breezy this afternoon, lighter winds tomorrow, high 88, uh, breezy and windy Thursday, Friday, and there are those high temperatures finally hitting 90. It looks like now by Friday, and once we do get there on Friday, uh, that's going to be the number uh, at least it looks like for the weekend and early next week.